Are y'all waiting on this over there, right? Okay, let me show you real quick. Uh, go, go, go to Proverbs 11.30. I'm going to show you. I, I'm going to tell you what I wanted to tell you. I'm going to give you the definition. I want you to write down. But let me just show you something about the tree of life. Proverbs 11.30. Y'all there? Hey. <laughs> Hallelujah. That's the first time. I'm not even there. I'm trying to get there now. Okay, okay, okay. Y'all probably didn't read it already. Okay. Proverbs 11 and 30 said, The fruit of the righteous is... <clears throat> oh, you mean Jesus when he said... Hmm. Jesus said... If I abide in you, and you abide in me, you're going to bring forth fruit, and your fruit will remain. So if I'm not bearing fruit, then I'm not a part of the tree. What? I'm not playing with the scriptures. The scripture said when I'm bearing forth fruit, I don't care if it's 30, 60, or 100. That's a witness to other people. Then I'm connected to the tree of life. Why? Because what I produce is for the healing of the nations. It has medicinal purposes. It brings healing to the nations. We're so inverted, we become perverted. The enemy has made us try to get ourselves together. But we're connected. We have, a, we have the capability right now to partake of the tree of life. Y'all got that? You know, you see what it says, that he that winning souls is wise. So it, it connects the tree of life to soul winning. Some of us don't have fruit because we're not telling nobody about it. Uh, yeah, go to Proverbs 15 and 4. Y'all all right? Y'all still, still tracking with me? Uh oh, this is going to tell your neighbors, going to mess them up. So if you're a cursor, you in trouble. I'm just saying. That's, what is that? Uh oh, what is that? Oh, a wholesome tongue is a tree of life. Whoa, whoa! But for persons therein is a breach in the spirit. So when I don't know how to yield my tongue to God, see a wholesome tongue. So you mean if I know how to speak things pleasing to people? If I'm not, if I don't have a razor tongue, so some of y'all, some people, not y'all, some people, let <laughs> me back off there. Some people are real boisterous and, and arrogant and say, I speak my mind. Yeah. <laughs> don't, don't, don't raise no hands. <laughs> if it, let, let them come this way. I, I'm going to tell it like it is. I'm not going to be nobody your man. You disqualify yourself from partaking of the tree of life. Because it's your tongue. Your tongue is set on the fires of hell. It's full of deadly poison. That's what the scripture says. See, we think it's all this big old stuff. It's mystical. It is, but it's not. It's practical. 